यू आर लिसनिंग मनोपात्रा पॉडकास्ट स्टेट यून टू गेट लेटेस्ट लीगल अपडेट्स Greetings everyone Manupatra brings to you the news highlights of 17th May 2023 Starting with the Supreme Court The Supreme Court while referring to Brigade Enterprises Limited versus Anil Kumar has held that upon a conjoint reading of section 2 sub clause 1 sub clause b sub clause 1 of Consumer Act 1986 consumer would also mean consumers The court while rejecting a plea to refer to Vijay Madan Lal Chaudhary judgment to a larger bench has stated that a grinding halt would be brought to pending investigations in money laundering cases if judgment is referred to a larger bench. The court while dismissing review petition filed against the constitution bench which upheld the validity of 103rd constitutional amendment that introduced 10% reservation for economically weaker sections in education and employment observed that there is no error apparent on the face of the record the court in suo motu case has directed the state governments and union territories to file their response as to why is there a demand for such kinds of illegal arms and ask them to go into socio economic reasons of the same the court has held that it is the duty of the referral court to conclusively decide the issue of existence and validity of an arbitration agreement if the same is raised at pre referral stage and stated that the said matter requires a thorough examination by the referral court The court has held that credit note issued by manufacturer of automobiles to its dealer in consideration of replacement of defective part pursuant to warranty agreement can be claimed by the dealer under sales tax. News highlights from the high courts. The Delhi High Court while referring to Jarnail Singh versus State of Haryana has held that for determining the age of a child victim under POCSO Act where bone ossification opines her age between 15 to 17 years inclination of court should be towards considering lower side on margin of errors the allahabad high court has directed judicial officers seeking claims for arrears of rent in cases where judicial officer was not provided government accommodation to raise such claims through their respective district judges and avoid recourse to judicial proceedings The Jammu and Kashmir and Ladakh High Court has held that if a warrant contained in existing plaint does not disclose court to have territorial jurisdiction and amendment is sought to vest territorial jurisdiction in the court the court will have no jurisdiction to even consider the application This concludes the news for today thank you so much